Hey, how's it going? Good. I'd like to sell my copy of Paradise Lost. Paradise Lost. Yes, sir. You should check the lost and found, man. <laughs> <laughs> I came to the pawn shop today to sell my Paradise Lost book. I'd like to sell it because it's way too heavy to keep around the house and moving around. I'd like to get 500 for it. I think the least I would probably take is 200. Paradise Lost. Yes, sir. Where did you get this? I was driving home from work, and I was stuck in traffic. And instead of staying in traffic, I decided to pull up the highway, and I saw an auction going on, so. Do you know anything about this? From what I've looked into it, the illustrator is a pretty famous guy. He did some illustrations for Paradise Lost, for Dante's Inferno, for the Bible. His name's Gustav Dory. Okay. And some pre pretty awesome pictures in there. So what is the Paradise Lost? It's a book of poems about the fall of you know man with Adam and Eve and the battle between Satan and God. This is probably the coolest engraving I've seen in the book so far. We got uh, Satan here with Adam and Eve in the background. Oh, yeah, I never even noticed them back there. Paradise Lost was written in the 17th century by an English poet, John Milton. His poem about Adam and Eve and the fall of man is considered one of the greatest works of literature in the English language. So saying he arose, whom Adam thus followed with benediction, since to part, go heavenly guest, ethereal messenger, sent from whom the sovereign goddess I adore, gentle to me, and oft return. What do you think that means? Sounds like Adam got a girl. <laughs> <laughs> um, so how much did you want for it? I was looking for about 500 for it. You know, if the book was in good shape, I could see a lot of money here, but it, it is pretty rough. Because there's water damage on this book, the binding's screwed up, but the engravings intrigue me. Yeah, I mean, the engravings are awesome. Let me have someone take a look at it. OK. I'll be right back. All right, great. I'm excited to see what the expert has to say about the book. I know that the illustrator is, you know, well known, so I'm curious to see, you know, how that plays into things. Hey, how's it going, Rebecca? Hey, Rick. Nice to see you. Paradise Lost is about two major events, the war in heaven and the fall of man. And both of these concern the concept of free will. It's probably safe to say that this is the most important poem in the English language, OK? Wow. And John Melton is someone who ranks almost as important as Shakespeare. OK. I like this quote right here. The mind is its own place, and in itself can make a heaven of hell or a hell of heaven. It's really beautiful. Here's the thing about this book. It is actually a first edition of sorts. It is from the 1860s, but it's the first appearance of the Gustave Doré illustrated Paradise Lost. OK. The true first came out in 1667, so this is much later, obviously. But Gustave Doré was a really important illustrator of the 19th century, and he's collected on his own terms. A really beautiful copy of this in a really beautiful binding that didn't have these condition issues could be worth up to about 2,000, 2,500. Wow. Okay. In this condition, you're looking at four to five hundred dollars. Okay, that's that's kind of what I was looking for. Good. Thanks, girl. You're the best. No problem. John? All right. If Rick does make a deal on this book, I think he should look into getting it rebound or restored somehow, because that will add value to the book as a whole, because the condition is so key. So how much you want for it? Well, I mean, she said four to 500, so maybe 350? No. No? <laughs> OK. Did you look at the book? I, I, I see the book, yes. Did you see the problems? I do, yes. OK. Um, I'll give you 200 bucks. It seems like there's a big base that you know would be interested in at least the illustrations of it, though. Can you do 275? I can give you 200 bucks. It's going to be a tough sell. It's it's going to sit for a long time. I want 250 for it. I'll go two and a quarter. All right, I can do two and a quarter. All right. All right, write them up, Chum. I mean, overall, I'm pretty happy with it. I only paid $50 for it, so I really can't complain.